Hello, and welcome to the Daily Orthodox Christian Scripture Reading for the 25th week after Pentecost, Thursday. The first reading of the day is from St. Paul's second letter to the Thessalonians, chapter 2, verses 13 through 17, and chapter 3, verses 1 through 5. Brethren, we are bound to give thanks to God always for you. Brethren, beloved by the Lord, because God chose you from the beginning to be saved, through sanctification by the Spirit and belief in the truth, To this he called you through our gospel, so that you may obtain the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ. So then, brethren, stand firm and hold to the traditions which you were taught by us, either by word of mouth or by letter. Now may our Lord Jesus Christ himself and God our Father, who loved us and gave us eternal comfort and good hope through grace, comfort your hearts and establish them in every good work and word. Finally, brethren, Pray for us that the word of the Lord may speed on and triumph as it did among you, and that we may be delivered from wicked and evil men. For not all have faith, but the Lord is faithful. He will strengthen you and guard you from evil. And we have confidence in the Lord about you, that you are doing and will do the things which we command. May the Lord direct your hearts to the love of God and to the steadfastness of Christ. And today's Gospel reading is from Luke, chapter 18, verses 31 through 34. At that time, Jesus, taking his twelve disciples, said to them, Behold, we are going up to Jerusalem, and everything that is written of the Son of Man by the prophets will be accomplished. For he will be delivered to the Gentiles, and will be mocked, and shamefully treated, and spit upon. They will scourge him, and to kill him. And on the third day, he will rise. But they understood none of these things. This saying was hid from them, and they did not grasp what was said. Thank you for listening. Let the brightness of the Lord our God be upon us and direct the works of our hands to do good. See you tomorrow.